ओके डे स्टूडेंट्स वी आर इन एम सेट मैथमेटिक्स ओके एंड वी हैव स्टार्टेड ए लोकस चैप्टर एंड टू क्लासेस आल्सो हैव फिनिश्ड अप टू क्वेश्चन नंबर 10 वी हैव फिनिश्ड आई थिंक अराउंड 30 मोर क्वेश्चंस वी विल डू इन दिस क्लास वी आर गोइंग टू डू अनदर फाइव क्वेश्चंस दैट मींस क्वेश्चन नंबर 11 टू 15 ओके सी व्हाट दे हैव गिवन इन क्वेश्चन नंबर 11 This question is asked in M set 2018. A quadrilateral ABCD is divided by the diagonal AC into two triangles of equal areas. Okay, ha. Huh. If ABC are respectively three four minus three six and minus five one, then the locus of D. See, he is not asking to asking us to find the D points. He is asking us to find the locus. Why? Because we are dealing with the chapter of locus. Okay. See, let us first to draw one figure. Why? Because quadrilateral is telling quadrilateral how it looks like. Is it okay? Quadrilateral. Okay. Quad sides. Four sides will be there. Okay. See, diagonal is giving us diagonal. Diagonal clearly he has mentioned. Diagonal is AC. You have to take AC as diagonal. Take like this. AC you take as diagonal. Okay. Remaining BD anyway you can take. That is not a problem. But this you should take as a uh, AC. Okay. You take this as B and this as D. Okay. Huh. And one more important point they have given. ABC or respectively ABC points they have given D they have not given then D you take as X Y that is okay that is not a problem okay ha huh. locus of D is asking C one more important point they have given two equal triangles that means ADC triangle area is equal to ABC area that means area sir. A quadrilateral ABC is divided by the diagonal AC into two triangles of equal area. See what I am writing. Observe carefully. See what I am writing. Equal areas means uh, like this. You have to write. See delta A C B is equal to delta A C D. A C B A C D. Okay, ah, that means areas of both equal. What is the area formula? Area formula we know. I am writing. You see, area formula. You see, delta is equal to half modulus of x one y two minus y three plus x two y three minus y one plus x three y one minus y two modulus plus. This is the formula for Area, yeah. okay. See one by one we take. Why? Because see D point we don't know, but A B C points we know. That is why I am writing A B C and we will write uh, the area also. Uh, okay. See first let us take the delta A C B. A C B that is equal to A C D also. Okay. See delta A C B is equal to implies I am writing first. Let me write A B C points. A, A is how much? Three comma four. B minus three comma six. C. Uh, we will write C for next. Okay, C. A, B, C respectively they are telling this. This is A, this is B, this is C. But here we are taking A, C, B. A, C, B. Always A, B, C also we can take. Already we have taken this A, B, C. A B C A B C like that also we can take that is not a problem okay ha C A C C is what C is minus five comma one then B B is what B is minus three comma six okay C you how to write this then only you can put x one y one and all see how I am writing x one y one see this is x one this is y one x two y two x three y three then you apply this sir, formula okay then you apply this formula delta a c b is equal to half modulus of x one x one is three into see y two y two is one minus y three minus six 
plus x2. See, x2 is minus is there. That is why you keep minus 5 into y3. y3 is 6. Okay? Uh, uh, minus y1. See, y1 is 4. Minus 4. Plus x3. x3 is how much? Minus 3. That is why you keep minus 3. y1. y1 is how much? 4. Minus y2. y2 is 1. Okay? Then close the modulus. Is it correct? First you see why? Because if you do some mistake here, then you are not going to get the answer. Okay? Uh, okay. See, straight away you see 1 minus 6 is minus 5 minus 15. Six minus four is two. Two into minus five minus ten. Four minus one is three. Three into minus three minus nine. Close the model. You see, all are negative. That means see, twenty-five plus nine, thirty-four minus thirty-four. But modulus equals plus thirty-four. Thirty-four by two. Is it okay? Why? Because modulus it is, that is why it is going to become 17. See, delta ACD is 17. Both are equal means delta ACD also should come 17. Okay, but ACD, how you are going to calculate? Why? Because D point you don't know. D point, only AC you know. Again, you write delta ACD. Let us write. See what I am writing. Delta ACD is equal to, implies I am writing. First, I am writing A, 3, comma 4. Then I am writing C minus 5 comma 1. Then I am writing D. D is say X, Y. Why? Because D point they have not given. Okay. Uh, then uh, you apply X1, Y1, X2, Y2, X3, Y3. Okay. Okay. Then uh, you substitute this. You substitute delta. A C D is equal to half modulus of X1. X1 is 3 into Y2 1 minus Y3. Y3 is almost see Y3 is Y here. 1 minus Y. Okay. Huh. Then you see uh, plus X2. X2 is minus minus 5. Okay. Y3 minus Y1. Y minus 4. Close. Uh, then x3. x3 is how much here? x3 is x plus x into y1 minus y2. 4 minus 1. Close. Okay. Uh, then we proceed further. Half. See, within the modulus, 3 minus 3y. 3 minus 3y. 3 minus 3y. Minus 5y plus 20. Minus 5y plus 20. Okay. Huh. 4x minus x. Plus 4x minus x. You close the modulus. Okay. See, uh, this is not a fair figure. Why? Because xy's are there. Now you see what you are going to do. That is equal to half modulus of 4x minus x is 3x. Write down 3x. And uh, minus 5y, minus 3y, minus 8y, write down minus 8y. Okay. Uh, now you go for C. X and Y are over. Now 20 plus 3, 23 plus 23 plus 23. Close the modulus. Okay. See, this is there. But uh, they have given both are equal. Here we have already written. See what I am writing now. As per this. Uh, 17 is equal to half of 3x minus 8y plus 23 modulus. You send this to this side, 34. That means you see modulus of 3x minus 8y plus 23 is equal to 34. You write up to here, what we are going to do? We are going to rub the board top and we are going to do further. Okay? Okay, see, I am rubbing up to here. I am rubbing only this question. Let me rub the question. 
okay they are asking us to find uh, what we can say locus locus of point d they are asking locus of point d means naturally x y in form of x y will come x y is d only that means whatever the thing we are doing that is the locus of this thing only. okay see we know one thing see here i am writing modulus x is equal to plus or minus k sorry modulus x is equal to k then x is equal to plus or minus k this formula we know property formula whatever you take theorem okay See, I am removing this modulus. See what will happen now. 3x minus 8y plus 23 is equal to plus or minus 34. Is it correct? Definitely correct. Why? Because plus or minus k. This is constant. Okay. See here what will happen. 3x minus 8y plus 23 plus or minus 34 equal to 0. Okay, uh, see if that is the case, that is the case. You see, once you take plus 34, another time you take minus 34. Okay, see 3x minus 8y. If I take plus 34, 57 plus 57 equal to 0, or if I take minus 34, minus 34 means minus is bigger. 3x minus 8y. Uh, 1 to 1 minus 11 minus 11 equal to 0 okay. see this is the answer locus why because locus are two equations because modulus is there locus are two equation 3x minus 8y plus 57 equal to 0 or 3x minus 8y minus 11 equal to 0 like this you have to write and close this question okay let us go for 12th question okay see question number 12 the locus of a point such that the sum of its distances from points 0 2 and 0 minus 2 is 6 then what is the locus like is asking that means locus of that point like okay see one diagram i am drawing then you can understand by seeing it you see one point is there p okay see here a here b a will be like 0 2 p will be like 0 minus 2 okay 0 minus 2 P will be x5, we know very well. What they have asked, uh, its distance from that point is both sum of the distance is uh, 6. You see, sum of the distance means PA plus PB is equal to 6. PA plus PB distance is equal to 6. So, what is the locus like they are asking? Naturally, we are going to get y because see, P, x, y is not, P is x, y. That is not a what we can say. Uh, numbers they have given naturally x minus 0 whole square that in formula like it will come okay see here uh, what we have to do see one thing i want to tell pa will be in square root form okay what we can do we can avoid square root and we will square it okay you see what we will write i am writing pa is equal to 6 minus pb P A is equal to 6 minus P B. Okay. I have sent P B that side. Squaring on both sides will give P A square is equal to 6 minus P B whole square. Okay. P A P B distance. Okay. See again I am writing P A square is equal to A minus B whole square. A square 36 plus B square P B square minus 2ab minus 2 into 6 12 pb minus 12 pb okay uh -huh. except this pb you write remaining all p a square pb square p a square means what see now you need not keep any square square root okay why because already we are doing a square but pb we will keep like that only see what i am writing p a square is equal to p a square x minus 0 whole square plus the y minus 2 whole square this is pa square pa means root we have to keep but here square is there root we not we do not keep that is equal to 36 plus pb square what is pb square x minus 0 whole square plus y plus 2 whole square why because y minus of minus plus 2 whole square over no 
see minus 12 pp you write it but uh, see we are not keeping this uh, what we can say square root and all we are keeping pv like that only afterwards it is going to become pv square at the time again we are going to copy this pv square okay now let us see what will happen here okay see here logically here x minus 0 whole square x minus 0 whole square are going to get cancelled equal to this side that side that is very interesting minus 12 pv i want to send this side see what i am doing minus 12 pv if, if I send this side, it is going to become 12 PB. 12 PB is equal to, okay? Huh. See, 36 is there, okay? Plus, uh, Y plus 2 whole square is there, okay? See, this plus, uh, if it goes this side, minus Y minus 2 whole square. Okay? Uh, now, see, we know A plus B whole square minus A minus B whole square is equal to 4 AB. 4 into 2 into Y, 8 Y, that's all, okay? Write down again. 12 pb is equal to 36 plus 8y is it okay now you square on both sides why because pb square it is going to become pb square you can write directly okay that logic you have to apply okay see squaring on both sides i am doing i think we can divide with four okay four threes four nines four twos this is going to become like this 3pb is equal to 2y plus 9 okay 3pb is equal to 2y plus 9 now you square on both sides okay 9pb square is equal to is equal to 2y plus 9 whole square 2y plus 9 whole square means a square 4y square plus b square 81 plus 2ab plus 2 into 2 into 9 4 into 9 36 y plus 36 y okay come on see this side how squared but what about this pb square pb square value right again 9 times of i think no 4 is there 4 it will not divide okay you have to write 9 into pb square pb square means x minus 0 again i don't write x minus 0 x square directly i am writing x square plus y plus 2 whole square ah, this you write y plus 2 whole square okay see you did not keep under root why because here square is there pb square pb means you have to keep root pb square is there you did not keep any root okay this side this side 4 y square plus 36 y plus 81 see here x square is there here x square is not there huh? that you keep in our mind okay now uh, proceed further uh, you expand it first 9 times of x square plus a square plus b square plus 2ab 2 into 2 into 4y 4y is equal to 4y square plus 36y plus 81 Come. See 9y square. Yes, 9y square. That's all. Write down. Uh, you expand this. Or else you bring this side. 9x square plus 9y square minus 4y square. I am writing, you see. What I am writing? 9x square will be there. 9y square minus 4y square plus 5y square. Plus 5y square will be there. Okay, comma I have kept it. Okay. Uh, and uh, 36y, uh, see, plus 36y, 36y, both sides, y v is going to be cancelled. 4, 9 into 4, 36, 36y. Okay. Uh, that is okay. 9 into 4, 36, but this side is 81. You send this 36 that side. 81 minus 36. Okay. Uh, what will be the final answer? You see, 11 minus 6 is 5, 7 minus 3 is 4, 45. Okay, see, 9x square plus 5y square is equal to 45. This will be the answer. This is the locus. This is the locus. This is not a circle. You see, why? Because x square, y square coefficient should be same. Then only this is going to become circle. They have not asked uh, to write uh, uh, what we can say. They are asked to write equation only. That is why we have written equation. 
Okay, if they give circular line in and all, then I am going to write those also and we will write that. Okay, take this, we will go for 13th question. Okay, see question number 13. If a point P moves such that the sum of the distances from P to the points A and B, see A is 1 minus 1, B is minus 1, 1, is always 4. Then the equation for the locus of point P, see, this is like the earlier question only, see, even though why I have taken means, see, uh, this type of model are going to come a uh, little bit extra in this locus. That is why we will do two or three more questions like this. Okay? Uh, see, uh, like earlier question only, see what I am writing. See, PA, PB are equivalent to 4. They are telling. Okay? P, they are not given. P, you have to take. You see, let P is this one. Okay? A, B. P is like x, y, a is they have given 1 comma minus 1, b they have given minus 1 comma 1, okay, p a plus p b, distance they have given, p a plus p b equal to 4, okay, huh. that distance they have given, see first to how I am proceeding this question, like earlier question only, how I am writing, see this question is asked in MC 2018, okay, huh. okay. see, P A plus P B. See distance, sum of the distances is equal to 4 means see what will happen. P A plus P B is equal to 4. Okay. Like earlier only, P A is equal to 4 minus P B. Is it okay? Definitely okay. Now I am squaring on both sides. Why? Because I want to avoid square root. That is why I am squaring on both sides. See P A square is equal to P A square is equal to 4 minus P B whole square. Okay, see what will happen. P A square is equal to A square 16 plus B square P B square minus 2 A B minus 2 into 4 into P B. 2 into 4 8, 8 P B minus 8 P B. See this 8 P B I am keeping like this only. Uh, uh, yeah. Okay, see, now what I am writing, I am substituting, now, I am substituting, but even then you see, 8 PB I can take this side, that also I can do, see what will happen, 8 PB is equal to 16 plus PB square minus P S square. PB square minus PA square, 8 will be this side gas comes. Now, 8 will be you keep like the term, direct like that only and proceed further. See what will happen. 8 PB is equal to 16 okay, plus PB square. You see PB square means what? See, PB is distance with the square root. But PB square means square root you can avoid. X plus 1 whole square, write down. X plus 1 whole square plus y minus 1 whole square, y minus 1 whole square, see this is pb square, minus, minus p a square, p a square means x minus 1 whole square, okay, plus you keep no, why because outside minus is there, again minus you have to keep minus, okay, y plus 1 whole square, understand this, okay, See what will happen here, x plus 1, a plus b whole square minus a minus b whole square, 4ab. a minus b whole square minus a plus b whole square, minus 4ab, that's all. Okay, write down. Comma, 8pb is equal to, 16 will be like this only, plus, see x plus 1 whole square minus x1 minus 1 whole square, 4ab means 4 into x into 1. 4x, that's all. 4x. Okay. See, plus, minus. But here you see, y minus 1 also. Say plus, minus. But minus plus means minus you take common. Minus if you take common, minus 4y. Okay. Now, what will happen? You divide with 4. 2 times, 4 times, 1 time, 1 time. What will happen this? This will happen this. You see, 
टू पी बी इज इक्वल टू फोर प्लस एक्स माइनस फाइव इज इट ओके नाउ यू स्क्वायर ऑन बोथ साइड वाई बिकॉज सी ये प्लस बी प्लस सी होल्स कर ए प्लस बी माइनस सी होल्स कर यू हाउ टू डू ओके हाँ सी स्क्वेरिंग ऑन बोथ साइड फोर पी बी स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू फोर पी बी स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू दिस साइड यू सी ए प्लस बी माइनस सी होल स्क्वायर ए स्क्वायर प्लस बी स्क्वायर इवन दो माइनस फाइव स्क्वायर मीन्स प्लस वाई स्क्वायर ये भी आर पॉजिटिव प्लस टू ये भी प्लस टू इंटू फोर इंटू एक्स एट एक्स प्लस टू बी सी मीन्स माइनस इज देर माइनस टू बी सी माइनस टू एक्स वाई ओके हाँ माइनस टू सी ए वाई बिकॉज माइनस इज देर माइनस टू इंटू फोर एट वाई माइनस एट वाई ओके हाँ सी हियर पी बी स्क्वायर मीन्स आ गए यू हैव टू राइट दिस वन ओके राइट डाउन then here all are separate yeah, x square is separate y square is separate x is separate y is separate 2xy is separate you can't do anything okay now let us proceed further 4 into b square 4 into p b square see 4 into p b square how i am writing x plus 1 whole square plus y minus 1 whole square okay ha huh. Is equal to 16 plus x square plus y square plus 8x minus 8y minus 2xy. Okay. Uh, now proceed further. Why? Because see, four you cannot send this side why? because there only single single x is there. Okay. That is why you can you cannot send her. Now wait. Four. See, x square plus b square plus 2ab. Plus y square plus b square minus 2ab is equal to this is 16 plus x square plus y square plus 8x minus 8y minus 2xy. Okay. Ah. Now you see 4x square minus x square 3x square. Okay. Let me expand after what will uh, cancel out. 4x square. Plus four y square plus eight x minus eight y. Okay. Now one plus one two two into four eight plus eight is equal to. This side you copy that. Sixteen plus x square plus y square plus eight x minus eight y minus two x y. Okay. See. Is there any same term? Yes. Yeah. Minus eight y minus eight y plus eight x plus eight x is there. Then you can solve that sum equal to that side. The plus eight x plus eight x minus eight y minus eight y. Two x y this side is not there. Eight is there. You set this eight that side. Okay. It is going to become eight. Four x square minus x square three x square. Uh, now let me finalize the answer. You see, four x square minus x square three x square. 3x square, 4y square minus y square, 3y square. Okay, ha. Huh. Wait. Now 8x 8y is not there. 8 is there. 8 you send that side. Okay, that will be okay. But what about c? X square, x y square uh, story over 8x y over. C minus 2x y is there. You bring this side plus 2x y, plus 2x y. Okay, see now send this 8 that side. 16 minus 8 is 8. 3x square plus 3y square plus 2xy is equal to 8. This is the locus of this point P. Okay? Ah. Uh, what else? Anything else is there? No, nothing is there. Okay? Ah. Uh, take this. We'll go for 14th question. Okay? See question number 14. Here they are asking us locus, but not equation. Representation of locus they are asking. See, what is the locus of P represents? Representation of locus means ellipse, vertical line, horizontal line, circle, whatever it may be. After getting equation or something like, then we can decide what is this uh, locus and all. Okay, whether it is a circle or semi-circle, not semi-circle, ellipse, straight line, pair of straight line, whatever it may be. Okay. Ah, see, let us study the question first. 
P is a vertical line that we know very well. P A P B equal to four like that. They have given two point. They have given this. This like earlier question only. But you see, rather than getting equation, you have to see representation. What will be this like? Okay. See, let me proceed further. See what I am writing. Uh, distance. Sum of the distance equal to four. See, like earlier question only. You see, P A plus P B is equal to four. Okay. P A plus P B equal to four. That they have given some of the uh, distances. Okay. See what I am converting like earlier question only. P A is equal to four minus P B. This also we know. Okay. Now squaring on both sides is going to become P A square is equal to A minus B whole square. A square plus B square minus two A B two into four P B eight P B. Is it okay? Yes, definitely okay. Now I want to bring minus eight PB this side and all that side. You see what will happen? Eight PB is equal to sixteen plus PB square minus P A square. Okay. Ah. Now let us proceed. Eight PB you keep like this only, like earlier question we have done earlier. Okay. Ah, write down. Eight PB is equal to. Sixteen plus P B square. P B square means what? X minus two whole square. See, we have got experience. That is, I have not written again P X Y Y something like I have not written. Why? Why? Because we have got some experience. P B square means X minus two whole square plus Y plus two whole square. So because minus two is there, minus. P S square. P S square means X minus two whole square minus already have given. X minus two whole square plus no minus why because outside minus is there minus X minus two whole square again okay. Y minus two whole square sorry Y minus two whole square okay ha huh. don't confuse okay now see X minus two whole square minus X minus two whole square you cancel directly that is the advantage for us plus X minus two whole square minus X minus two whole square now Y plus two whole square minus Y minus two whole square. A plus B whole square minus A minus B whole square. Four A B. Four into Y into two. Eight Y. Eight Y will come. You see what I am writing. Eight P B is equal into two sixteen plus eight Y. With eight I am dividing. You see eight ones, eight twos, eight ones. Then what is that? That is this. You see, P B is equal to two plus Y. Shall I write Y plus two? Why? Because here Y plus two I have written somewhere else. You see, Y plus two I have written. That is why I want to write Y plus two. See, you can write Y plus two or two plus Y. But two minus Y is not equal to Y minus two. That we know. Okay, Y plus two. P B is equal to Y plus two. Okay. Now I am squaring on both sides. P B square is equal to y plus two whole square. Now you stop. But P B square already have got some other value. You see P B square is what? Our second I am writing. But P B square is equal to x minus two whole square plus y plus two whole square. Is it okay? Here only we have written x minus two whole square plus y plus two whole square, but minus is there. That is why, sir, here x minus two whole square plus y plus two whole square. Same thing we have written again. Okay. See, p b square is this, p b square is this. Then you equate it. Then you equate it. You see what I am writing? Y plus two whole square is equal to x minus two whole square plus y plus two whole square. You set y plus two whole square this side. R is you cancel out. See addition you are cancelling means this side zero will be there. X minus two whole square is equal to zero. X minus two is equal to zero. X is equal to two. How that is going to represent x minus two? X is equal to two. You see. This is graph, say zero, one, and two. 
x is equal to 2 means you see at x we have to keep 2 point 2 this is a vertical line okay uh, not a horizontal line that means locus of this point is vertical line see it may be equation but finally you have to write a representation representation is vertical line okay x is equal to 2 is a vertical line let us go for 15th question okay see question number 15 if a 1 2 b 2 1 and p x y is a variable point satisfying the condition here you see here directly they are not given p a minus p b modulus they have given equal to 3 like then what is the locus of p like such type of questions also we have to do okay then only we will get some experience see first let us deal this uh, modulus uh, thing see we know very well modulus of x is equal to if it is k then x is equal to plus or minus k will come okay like that we will write you see how i am changing this thing p a minus p b but under modulus is equal to 3 then p a minus p b is equal into 2 plus or minus 3 okay i have removed modulus then plus or minus 3 i have kept that side okay now you see set this minus that side PA is equal to PB plus or minus 3. Is it okay? Well, because of minus it goes plus, becomes plus. Now again you square it on both sides. Okay? PA square. PA square is equal to A plus B whole square. See here, see A plus B or A minus B whole square. A square plus B square is same, but plus 2ab minus 2ab are different that is why again we will write plus or minus 2ab okay see a square plus b square plus or minus 2ab 2 into 3 into pb 6 pb is it okay first thing you observe okay ah. plus or minus pb okay see uh, Shall I write plus or minus pb this side? Like earlier question only. Write down. Plus or minus 6 pb is equal to 9 plus pb square minus pa square. Is it okay? Definitely okay. See this side plus or minus is there. Huh? Don't forget it. This pb last we will uh, substitute. Until then we need that. But uh, I am... I'm, uh, uh, what we can say? I am proceeding with plus or minus 6 pb is equal to 9 plus pb square. Huh? pb square means x minus 2 whole square plus y minus 1 whole square minus p a square. x minus 1 whole square. No plus y because minus is there. Minus x y minus 2 whole square. Is it okay? Definitely okay. Now wait. See here. X minus 2 is there. X minus 1 is there. Y minus 1 is there. Y minus 2 is there. All are different. You how to expand that solve? Okay. Huh. You don't have any other option. Let us expand. Plus or minus 6 PB is equal to 9 plus. Write down. A minus B whole square. A square plus B square minus 2 into 2. 4 X. Yes plus y minus 1 whole square a square plus b square minus 2y see here minus is there don't forget a square means minus x square b square means minus 1 minus 2ab means minus 2x but outside minus is there plus 2x a square means minus is there minus y square plus 4 but outside minus minus 4 minus 2 into 2y minus 4y but outside minus is there plus 4y okay uh, now wait is there any cancellation definitely why because plus x square minus x square cancel out plus y square minus y square cancel out Plus 4 minus 4 cancel out. 
माइनस फोर एक्स प्लस टू एक्स ओके हाँ प्लस वन माइनस वन कैंसिल हो ओके हाँ व्हाट इज नथिंग इज देयर ओके नाउ प्रोसीड फर्दर नाउ प्रोसीड फर्दर प्लस फोर माइनस सिक्स पी बी इज इक्वल टू इसी नाइन आई थिंक नाइन ओनली व्हाई बिकॉज़ नो अदर नंबर इज देयर ओके नाइन Plus two C A. Why because both are plus two into two four into nine thirty six Y plus thirty six Y. Okay. Ah. Okay. Now wait. But uh, see here four is there with three it will not go. Let it be like this only. See one thing I can say P B square. We have not at uh, what we can say done here. Let us done. Uh, let us do P B square also. Thirty-six into thirty-six into P B square value. P B square is where P B square is this one. X minus two whole square plus Y minus one whole square is equal to. Uh, I think we will write first to four X square plus four Y square minus thirty-six X. Minus R uh, plus thirty six Y minus eight X Y. Now you write plus eighty one. Okay, ha. This will be good. Okay. Now you expand this. You don't have any other option. You expand and you send thirty six inside. But because like this only you have to do this question. Okay. Thirty six into A square plus B square minus two A B. Plus y square plus b square minus two y b is equal to four x square plus four y square minus thirty six x plus thirty six y. Okay, minus y eight x y plus y eighty one. Okay. Now you send thirty six inside. Thirty six x square minus four x square. Let it be. First of all, let us do. Thirty-six x square. See here, four plus one five is there. Right now, thirty-six x square minus four x square. I think we will expand only this. Thirty-six x square plus thirty-six y square. Thirty-six into four, huh? Thirty-six into four. Seventy two one forty four one forty four x minus one forty four x and thirty six into two seventy two minus seventy two y. Now you see four plus one five five into thirty six one eighty. Okay, thirty five is our one fifty six five is our thirty one fifty plus thirty one eighty. Okay, one eighty plus one eighty. Plus one eighty is equal to. 
Again, you copy this thing. 4x square plus 4y square minus 36x plus 36y minus 8xy plus 8y. Okay. Pass and note down. I am rub, rubbing this question. Top. Okay. Ah, I think the board may not appear in camera. Okay. Thirty six minus four. Thirty two. Thirty two x square. Okay. Thirty six minus four. Thirty two y square. Okay. See minus one forty four x plus thirty six x. Okay. If this comes this side plus thirty six. Uh, minus one forty four. Plus thirty six eight three zero one not eight minus one zero eight x uh, again see minus seventy two minus thirty six minus seventy two minus thirty six eight one one zero minus one zero eight again minus one zero eight y okay again minus one zero eight y okay. Now you see minus eight x y. You bring this side plus eight x y plus eight x y. Okay. Now one eight is shall I send to that side? Or shall I bring this side? One eight minus eight one. One eight minus eight one. See ten minus one is nine. Seven will be there. Seventeen minus eight is nine. Plus ninety nine. Plus ninety nine is equal to zero. This is the locus of this equation. Okay, thirty two x square plus thirty two y square minus one zero eight x minus one zero eight y plus eight x y plus nine nine equal to zero is the locus of this equation. Okay, we we'll stop this class here. We will meet in the next class and we will continue. Thank you very much.